The search for the body of a missing Brunswick man is now over. The Georgia Department of Natural Resources says 39-year-old Michael Shreve's body was recovered around 10 o'clock this morning. They found Shreve's body in the Altamaha River. He was last seen jumping into the river Wednesday trying to save a dog who had also fallen in. Authorities say the river's current was too strong for Shreve to swim, and he drowned. Channel 4's Nicole Snyder is live in Brunswick tonight where they found that body. Nicole? Ethan, the Georgia DNR says they found Shreve's body about a half a mile down the river. And I talked to some kayakers out here who say the river appears to be calm, but actually when they paddle down it, the current is very strong. We have video of the search from earlier this week. Glenn County Emergency Management and the Georgia DNR use boats and side scan sonar to look for Shreve. There are signs posted here at the park warning visitors not to swim because of the strong currents. The search area was expanded yesterday up to two miles down the river, but it wasn't until this morning around 10 a.m. that Cruz found his body. There was no sign of the dog in that search. We talked to a group out here from the Georgia Conservancy who paddle down this river every year. They are taking extra precautions this weekend because of what happened to Shreve. The river doesn't look you know, dangerous or swift. It's large, so that's kind of deceptive. Um, there's a lot of water flowing through there. It's fast. It's tidally influenced. There's a lot of hidden trees. So it's a lot of danger out there that you can't necessarily see from the docks. But once you get on the water in a boat, you can really feel the pull of the river. And that group says they're going to have more safety boaters out here this weekend. They also want to make sure everyone is wearing a life vest who enters the river. I'm live in Brunswick, Nicole Snyder, Channel 4, The Local Station.